Reed and you're watching Race Your Girl Television. Uh, I'm driving down the highway today because it's a big day for me. Um, I uh, am going to pick up a new car. Uh, I'm totally stoked because uh, I worked something out with our local Subaru dealer. Uh, Bob Saunders has been a sponsor of cycling and essentially endurance sport in Victoria for like probably going on 20 years. And I remember him uh, sponsoring the national cycling team like when I first started. And uh, today is the day where Mel gets her own sponsorship and I'm gonna have a much hotter car than I've got right now. So I'm pretty stoked about this. So um, if you wanna come with me, we're gonna go check out the dealership and we're gonna go see my new car. Everything cool. 107.3. Cool.fm. Uh, this is John, and uh, he's going to tell me all about the awesomeness of my new car. So uh, let's follow along. The 2012 STI Impreza. <laughs> 305 horsepower, supercharged, turbocharged, all-wheel drive. This is the car that wins World Rally races, just like World Xterra races. <laughs> okay. She's got the alloy wheels. We went out and found her a special bike rack. And uh, beyond that, this is going to take her anywhere and everywhere she wants to go. Sweet ass. Okay, hi. We're all here in my uh, new WRX STI. I'm with uh, Bob Saunders and David's in the back seat. Hi, everybody. Hi. This is my new car. Um, so, Bob? I think you were sponsoring cyclists when I was like first starting cycling. You were, and that's, I don't know how many moons ago, but it was, it was a, a long time. Long time. So how can we have such a soft spot for athletes? What's the well, deal? I think cycling is the greatest sport and their greatest athletes. They, they can sure crank you up and they turn your heart too. Oh, that's awesome. So you've helped now Stephanie Dixon and you've gone way back with Roland and Ryder and yeah. Seamus and, well, even the and coaches. And Silk and Lawman, yeah. Yep. And, Simon Whitfield. Yeah. yeah. So pretty much anybody who's anybody in Victoria is pretty much had uh, benevolence from Bob. Yeah, and I've been really blessed. I meet a lot of people like you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's a blessing or not, but oh, you know, it's, know. it's always it's always a story to happen. <laughs> so tell me, Bob, like, how many speeding tickets am I going to get on this car now? You're going to have a lot of fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so okay, I'm gonna have to set a budget for tickets. Um, but now that I have this car, it actually matches my bikes, right? So oh. you know, I needed I needed like a high performance car to go with my high performance bikes, right? Uh, yeah, I got nothing against the wagon, but when you said I said, Edie, that's Melanie's car all over. <laughs> so I was really happy when you did this choice. Yeah, I'm not saying wagons are for old farts like me, <laughs> but for you. This is your car. Yeah, this is definitely, there, there's no question I always wanted the wagon because, well, actually, you know, I'm not always um, riding bikes and swimming and running. Like, sometimes I'm gardening, right. you know, and I need to drag dirt around, and you, you know? And you have to get to the garden shop quick. Exactly. <laughs> well, see, my fatal flaw in life is how late I always am, so I just figured I needed a faster car so I could try to address that weakness. Well, I've never seen you late too often. I see you at the finish line all the time. <laughs> People have driven this car really, really fast. Yeah. So what's what's some of Subaru's like accomplishments? Well, Subaru's accomplishment is, number one, you're driving one of the safest cars on the road you can get. We're the most advanced uh, car in the world in the all-wheel drive. And it's a rally car. If this you want to use it for rallies, you can go rally with it if you like. And if you don't want to rally, it's an everyday car. This is true. This is true. Where's the closest test track? Western Speedway. Western Speedway? Yeah. I could rip around the Speedway in this thing? Oh, we, we could arrange that for you. Seriously? Yeah. How cool would that be? Does Max, oh, Max Plaxton, he's another Subaru yeah. driver. Does Max have his car yet? Yeah, he's got his car. I don't know how many tickets he's got yet. Yeah, no, I don't. <laughs> Do you think that I could beat Max on the Speedway? Oh, I think oh. so. So where are you off to in your next big meet? Uh, my season's going to start in April. And I'm going to start the season with the Ironman circuit with that half Ironman in Oceanside. Oh, good for and you. Then, and then I go to Las Vegas to start the off-road Oh, stuff. let me know when you go down there because I like Las Vegas. Oh, Las Vegas is good.
They're all, they're all athletically inclined, but they love biking. They like racing. I think they like the energy level of it, too. Mm -hmm. But the biking, they're such neat, neat, neat people. I've met so many great people in yeah. biking. Are you going to race Bastion Square again this year? Oh, you heard about that, did you? <laughs> yeah, probably. That's awesome. <laughs> I think you'd like a little bit of Subaru under the hood. That's, that was so good. That is awesome. Yeah, you have yeah. to do that again. But you know, you just got to take people by surprise. Like when they say go, like just take off. Well, like I, just go. Oh, well, I did that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but you got to lap the field. You just got to oh. go for it and like come around the back and go, it what's taking you guys so long? It wouldn't have looked right if I beat uh, the hockey player from Vancouver. <laughs> Trevor Linden? Yeah. yeah, that would have been awesome. Trevor, you're going down. Bob's taking you out. You got nothing. <laughs> <laughs> they wanted me to go up front. I said, oh, no. <laughs> My new car That's is awesome. all-wheel drive. And mm -hmm. uh, since I'm totally disorganized and I never put actual other tires on my car, it's good that it's all-wheel drive, right? Because it will Absolutely. actually drive pretty well in the snow. Well, oh, yeah. it'll drive incredible in the snow. Even with the tires, the all-terrain tires on it right now. Yeah. 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 See, this is the thing. In Victoria, we get snow for about 45 minutes, and then it's like seven feet deep, and then it melts about 45 minutes later. So you basically never want to change your tires because it's a total waste of time. So you actually should always have all-wheel drive here. Otherwise, you're probably going to be stranded because we also have about half a plow for the whole city, yep. right? Yeah. So it's really tough to actually deal with snow here, even though you really don't ever have to. Sometimes you might and you need a car to manage that and stuff. my other my comp competitions their <clears> cars are all reactive the cars actually have to slide first before their system engages and when they hit the brakes they disengage so many customers have bought my opposition cars they always come back to subaru because it's much safer <laughs> well you know the other thing about all-wheel drive is it's actually really good you don't really hydroplane too nope. and that's one of the things on the west on the west coast and around here it's like it's always raining and there's standing water and you could probably hydroplane off the road. So all-wheel drive is really good for that stuff That's too. That's why my wife has it. We yeah. have three daughters and uh, they gotta be safe. So. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks to uh, the, the boys at Subaru, uh, Mel's now in a hotter car and uh, life is good. So thanks for watching Race Girl Television. See you next time.